Hey there, everybody! Welcome to the Film Pigs on Geek Nation. We are a web series that's all about the movies, you guys! The boobies? The boobies? No, the movies. The boobies. Unfortunately, uh, no, the movies. He's not really listening because yeah. he's looking I at the phone. I thought this was about the boobies. <laughs> the rest of the internet is about the boobies. This is a good We're point. about the movies. Okay. I am your host, Mirror Universe Steve Skelton. I'm here with Stephen Falk. Hello. Todd Robert Anderson. And our very special guest, back for the second show in a row, Daryl Brick Gibson. Daryl! Hey! You guys oh see that? Do some acting. Do a line. <laughs> Just, you said you'd never leave me. Oh! oh amazing. Woo. Fantastic. I mean, Fantastic. damn, dude. Oh, oh my God. Damn. We got a yeah. just a little pop yeah. for that. Oh, Woo! Felt oh, oh, that one in my chest. Almighty. Felt that in my chest. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Guys, let's jump right into this thing. Mm. Fuck mm. that. Yeah, let's do let's it. Let's get into this with some rash judgments. <sighs> what are they, you may ask? Rash judgments are where we take a look at the movies that are coming out soon mm -hmm. and tell you, the hardworking viewer, whether you should or should not go see them, based entirely on our own dickish opinions. We haven't seen these movies. No. We no. don't know anything nope. about them. Nothing. Not Maybe not we've watched Zero. a trailer. Who knows? Maybe. But listen to us anyway, Stephen Falk. Do you like South American politics? Do you like Sandra Bullock? Do you like director David Gordon Green? Who? Do you like political comedy? Then you're gonna like Our Brand is Crisis. No. The worst titled movie of all time. <laughs> Maybe since Digstown with Lou Gossett Jr. Oh, classic. Now, this classic. is a movie in which. Now, this looks like an HBO movie that they made 10 years ago where Sandra Bullock is a, a political, um, what do you call those, strategist. Mm -hmm. And she is hired by a South American uh, guy who's running for president, El Presidente. And she's going to run his presidential campaign, and she's pitted against um, uh, what's his name, um, Billy Bob Thornton, oh. who is great, mm -hmm. and he's playing the other campaign manager. They have a history, blah blah blah, a lot of yakky yakky back and forth. Eventually, Sandra Bullock. She starts off. She's like smoking cigarettes. She doesn't really give a shit. She's just in it for the Vic and the cash. And then soon she starts to get to know the people mm. and care oh, God. and really believe. Um, now, David Gordon Green has directed some good movies. I think he did Super Bad after oh, a yeah, bunch yeah. of indie stuff. I just saw he did a bunch of the Red Oaks, or, right? Red Oaks show on Amazon that I enjoy. Oh, yeah. I think it's what it's called. Uh, it's an 80s, 80s franchise. He's a pretty good director. Um, Sandra Bullock had a little resurgence of her career after what's his name? Fuck that uh, tattoo chick and left him with <laughs> her adopted child. Yeah. The blind side? Yeah, uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. She was fucked by the blind side? Is that what, is that where, that, that After happened. she got blindsided. It was, but it was, right, it was right around the movie. Her pussy, it was well, right around her the pussy got blindsided. Oh! And then she went into gravity. <laughs> and now, <laughs> she was in space, and then she fell on a beach. And then she went, she, went back to oh her, my. she went back to her house in Austin and refurbished some houses. And now she's back in a movie, baby. And it looks like a rental. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, Todd? Yeah, uh, okay, some of my favorite things to see in a movie. Oh, here we Boobs. go. Yeah. Boobs. Boobs. Yeah. Boobs. Zombies. Drinkings. Drinkings. Mm -hmm. uh, Boy Scouts. Yelling. Boy oh. Scouts. Boy Scouts. This movie what? is what? called The Scouts Guide to the Zombie Apocalypse, uh. and it's about a bunch of Boy Scouts who go to a strip club, and then they realize they're in the middle of a zombie apocalypse. It looks like a very, very, very funny horror comedy uh, especially the scene in the trailer where there's a bunch of zombie cats. It's really funny. They're like, like actual cats? Yeah, the cats are zombies, and there's like a shot of them holding a door closed, and all the zombie cat paws are like coming through the door trying to get in. <laughs> it looks great, you guys. I'm fucking seeing this movie, and so should you. Woo! Scout's Guide to the Zombie Apocalypse. Now, see it. Go, go. go. I, wow. I, I would I would posit that in all the years we've been doing this, three and a half years, something like that, uh, yeah. this is the most enthusiastic you for really, any really yeah. ever. want to see this. You yeah. are excited. I am wow. excited. It's got zombie cats. That's what really, like, I was like, oh, okay, Boy Scouts, in a, that, that's kind of funny. Oh, Boy Scouts hanging out with strippers, that's kind of funny. Right, right, right. Zombie cats? You're on This board. is a great movie. <laughs> it's a great movie. So if you didn't see the cats... Uh, he'd be like, eh. yeah. yeah, I get the Blu-ray. Right, right. right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll wait for video, but the cats, <laughs> that tips the scale. Seals, seals the deal. Tips the scales. Right. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Todd. Thank you, Todd. Daryl, do you have our Oh, job? I do. Um, so, um, Bradley Cooper, anybody a fan? 
out there. I don't. These guys don't seem to be. Um, I like my it. my love mm -hmm. of Bradley Cooper mm -hmm. is limitless. Oh, uh, well uh, done. Well, now, to, to uh, be to be fair, uh -huh. the uh, uh, Wet Hot American Summer uh, TV. Yeah. Oh yeah, Netflix. It's good. He's back in. He's very funny. Very yeah. good. He's, He's very good. very good. Mm -hmm. So um, I'm going to be talking about Burnt. Burnt is a Bradley Cooper film in which he plays a chef, and he seems to be oh. a very angry chef <laughs> in the trailer because it's just a bunch of plates being thrown, and um, I actually never know if he cooks anything in the film. <laughs> Probably it's not. just plates being Maybe thrown. Maybe that's why every... he's mad, because he doesn't right. really know how to cook. And so he talks to people, and he's basically like, I want to open up a restaurant. I'm the best chef. Everybody's like, oh, he's the best chef. We never see food in the trailer. Um, but I will say this. If there is food in it, I'm going, OK? Because any movie that has food in it, I see not only once, not only twice, I see them 10, 15 times. Ratatouille, 35 times. Chef, 100 times. What else has food in it, huh? Are you that hungry? I am. <laughs> Look at me, Steven. I haven't eaten in years, all right? I go to the movies. I could have bought a meal, but instead I go to the movies and just dream about the food. And what I do when I leave a movie that has food in it, I go home and try to cook the shit I saw on screen. And guess what happens? I good. almost burned my shit down. Yeah. Burnt. <laughs> well, awesome. Yes, Thank you so absolutely. much for that. Go see it. Enthusiastic uh, it, it, recommendation. I, I'm passionate about it's food. A couple of movies. Great People job. Go see yeah. yeah, great job, yeah. you guys. So yeah. good. Hey, you know, we have a very special treat this episode. What's that? Candy. Uh, Halloween candy. Candy. Not, candy. not uh, candy corn. I want oh. candy. We all want candy. We all want candy. Well, we yeah. don't, you know, we don't have, we don't have candy. But what we do have is an up and coming star. In Daryl, our guest. Yeah, oh God, he's I heard about this. He's in everything. Yes. He's on You're the Worst, yeah. Steve McFall yeah. show. Yeah. What, what? Uh, he's in the uh, Key and Peele movie, Keanu, that's coming oh, out soon. Yeah. April 22nd, yeah. baby. Oh my gosh, wow. you got to see yeah. that. What a lot of people don't know is he's also in kind of a small crime thriller movie. I love I small that. crime thrillers. Yeah, movies. and mm -hmm. uh, is there food in it? We, we I, well, there might be, but in the trailer, there's no food. Can't give it away. Yeah, you don't want no spoilers. No, 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 no. But we have the trailer, Ooh. exclusive. No one's seen it before. Oh, it's wow. the premiere. It's yeah. The premiere it's a world wow. premiere oh trailer. Oh world God. premiere trailer. So what do you guys think we should do? Oh, well, what do you? Here, just <laughs> grab that. Mm -hmm. Just got it. This is big, guys. Yeah, Whoa. Get, get, oh, Whoa. Whoa. You're looking. What? You're looking. What? 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 the cops knew we were going to hit that jewelry store. It's impossible, right? We were the only ones who knew the plane. I... What are you doing? Are you alright? 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 I'm shooting him right now! I'm shooting him right now! I'm shooting him right now! I'm sorry, I'm late. My Waze app sent me to a warehouse in Silver Lake. You started the standoff without me? Look. Yeah, you were late. Yeah, we didn't know if you were even gonna make it. Because of the cops and the whole thing. I was really looking forward to the standoff. You guys know the standoff is my favorite part. Yeah, um, we've actually been uh, meaning to talk to you about that. Um, you can't be a part of the standoff anymore. Yeah. What do you mean? It's just not working out. You're throwing off the whole dynamics of the group. It's, it's not you, it's just that well, we're used to uh, a traditional Mexican standoff. And that's three people and you make four. That's it, exactly. This feels really like it's coming out of left field. Really? I mean, you mean to tell me you haven't noticed anything in our last couple standoffs? Hmm? I mean, the awkwardness of standing in a square instead of a triangle? How our accusatory banter is all of a sudden off? You only have one gun, all right? We are used to a traditional Mexican standoff, which is three people holding two guns each. Does everyone feel this way? <sighs> yeah. Pretty much. I see. Well, 
I know when I'm not wanted. I guess I'll just, I'll go. Good luck with your standoff. I'm sorry, your traditional two-gun Mexican standoff. I mean, come on, guys. I'm not being a dick, right? I mean, he's been throwing the vibe off. No, you are absolutely correct. I agree 100%. Okay, makes me feel better. I eat bullets! I don't care! I don't care what happened to anyone! Oh my god! That looks really good! I like it was that. Like, oh my goodness! goodness. Thank you! And it was the like, supporting cast oh, was. They were, they were uh, adequate, I, I, I would I, say. I, yeah. There was one in particular that was really good, but. Let's not talk. Yeah, about but yeah, yeah. 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 The tall guy, right? Yeah. So yeah, yeah. So yeah, sure. Yeah, 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 one, yeah, one, of the, one of the bald guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We don't want to, you know. Yeah, like, you know friendships could like, be yeah, broken yeah, yeah, here. Wanna, We're not going to ruin it. Was, though. Uh, yeah. So yeah. exciting it's, to it's see that. It's so uncomfortable to ask him that. It's he's in the movie. There are people he's worked with. He can't. Right. Yeah, yeah. It's it's very unprofessional. This episode has had everything in it. Like everything. There's so many things that I can't even list them all, but I'll try. We started. Uh, we started. Yeah, we Ooh, had rash judgments. I remember beginning. Uh, <laughs> we had <laughs> trailers. We oh. had discussions. We had banter. Uh, it was plugs, amazing. Plugs. plugs. I don't think there's much else to do. There was physical now. comedy. There yeah, was a thing where I, I pretended a yeah, thing was yeah. Yeah. That, that was uh, Did you feel that? Yeah. yeah. That because yeah. I felt yeah. it. So um, is this been one of the best? I would say. The, like, best, the best, I would say. Back to back. Easy. Easy. Yeah, it's between this back to back. episode and the, and the last, last one. one. Really? Who was yeah. in the last one? Uh, I can't remember. I think, wait, you were. Holy oh, shit. my God. There we yeah. go. There yeah. we go. Yeah. So, I mean, there's not much left. That. Straight from the pig's mouth. There's not much left to say except thank you to Stephen Fold. Yes, so sir. Lonely. Thank you to Todd Anderson. Dang. Thank you very much to our special guest, two times in a row, Daryl Britt Gibson. Daryl! Watch him on You're the Worst Do on night. FXX. Monday oh. night, Wednesday night. Oh, you almost uh, killed us. 10.30, is it 10.30? Wednesday. Wednesday. 10 or 10.30. 10 30. 10.30. 10.30. Uh, Get with it. After the friggin' we, league. Yeah, after shit. the league. Watch it. Yeah. And, you know, until next time, the concession stand is closed due to health code violations. Suck. Suck it. What can you do? <laughs> Suck it. Suck it. Well, you can do so that. That, that. Yeah, that. Aggressively that's something angry. So <laughs> angry. <laughs> so <laughs> much Suck anger. Suck it, everyone. Sometimes you just get mad. Yeah. yeah. You get mad. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Audience. concession stand. <laughs> well, to be fair, it's been a problem for years. Yeah, it really is gross.